Well, now to this story here, a trillion dollar industry that fuels our local economy really depends on the ship channel and weather can, of course, be a huge impact on that big business. ABC 13's meteorologist Elise Smith has a behind the scenes look at how the Coast Guard runs this 24 seven operation. It's only on 13. We are extremely weather dependent. Alberto Hernandez has kept a watchful eye on the Houston ship channel and surrounding waterways for over 20 years. His team at the Vessel Traffic Center and U.S. Coast Guard are there to keep mariners safe and the money flowing. If you break down the, uh, the over $1 trillion in value, we're looking at $3 billion a day and $125 million an hour. An operation that takes place in one of the most disaster-prone regions in the country, the Gulf Coast. But from flooding rains to hurricanes, Alberto tells ABC 13 that the biggest culprit is... Fog is generally the greatest impact to the channel. So when we lose visibility, uh, in February we had a week-long event that we had fog every day on the channel, and we were losing 12, 18 hours of traffic uh, opportunity. So here's something you might not know. Galveston Bay and Trinity Bay are only about 10 feet deep. That can't accommodate larger ships. That's why we have the Houston Ship Channel. This narrow area here, it's 46 feet deep. It's only 700 feet wide, and there's only one way in and one way out. That's why knowing the weather forecast is critical. Earlier this year, the Houston Galveston Weather Service Office took part in a new program that brought agency meteorologists to the Vessel Traffic Center during times of impactful weather, like dense fog. And that resulted in letting us know uh, with, a, with a higher degree of availability that we had an hour or two more of an open period. In fact, at its worst, fog can shut down the ship channel for upwards of 600 hours a year. With a storm like Barrel, the channel was only closed for about 36 hours. So that's why fog and more fog cameras could be in the ship channel's future when it comes to mitigating economic loss due to the weather. Fog visibility cameras, that's a project that's ongoing with uh, the Lone Star Harbor Safety Committee, partnered with area port partners, the Coast Guard. And so these cameras allow us to really get a sense of how dense is the fog in any one particular location. Another topic is climate change. And living along the coast, sea level rise will continue to be a concern. But specifically for Houston, flooding rains and hurricanes could potentially impact these crucial waterways by changing their depth. Something concerning for the Houston Ship Channel and the millions of dollars that flow through it every hour. Reporting near Morgan's Point, meteorologist Elise Smith, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.